Hello, I am Purvi Maru and I am welcoming you all to my channel Food Health and Acupressure. Today we'll be talking about the most common problem of these days, which is cold and fever. As this change of season is increasing and many people are facing cold and fever, so today we'll be talking about these problems. So let us know about acupressure points before that. If you haven't subscribed my channel yet, then please do subscribe and do share this video with others so that they can also get this informative video. And if you want to join our WhatsApp group or Telegram group, then do join. Then do click on the link in the description box. And over here, you can see this is my Instagram page. You can also go and follow this page. On this page, we share many uh, many acupressure related posts. So first, let us discuss about acupressure points for cold. Okay, let us discuss about that points. So the uh, so for uh, for cold acupressure points, our point is on the front side of our hand on the index finger. Okay, so you can see this first joint of the index finger. Okay, just below that joint towards thumb is this point. On the first joint of the index finger, just below that joint towards thumb side is this point. This point is called as L U seven lung meridian seventh point. Okay. So on this point, what we'll do, we'll just take a uh, take a jimmy or it's backside of a jimmy, and then we'll press this point properly for a minute, okay? And then after that, what we'll do, we will do magnet therapy on this point. For that, we'll take paper tip and we'll take tonification sedation magnet or Buell magnet. If you are not having these magnets and if you want to buy them, then I have made a basic acupressure kit in which all these magnets, jimmies, and all the other things which we use in this therapy are included in it. I have also made a video on it. You can also check it out. And if you want to buy it, you can definitely buy it from us. So on a paper tip, we'll apply one tonification sedation magnet in such a way that the white side of the magnet will touch the skin, and from the outside we can see the yellow side of the magnet. Okay. So the white side will touch the skin and from from outside we can see the yellow side of the magnet. So we'll apply one tonification sedation magnet on this point properly. You need to do this treatment on both the hands as this point is bilateral. You need to apply this magnet for seven to eight hours and whenever you will remove it, you need to throw the paper tape away and bring both the magnets together so that they can energize themselves and you can use it again. Magnets do not expire and you can use it for lifetime. Do this treatment daily. You will definitely feel the results for cold. So now let us know about acupressure points for fever. So our acupressure point is on the back side of our hand on our thumb. Okay, you can see this last joint of our thumb. On this line, exactly in the center is this point. Okay, on the last joint of the thumb, exactly on the joint line, exactly in the center is this point. This point is called as GV14, Governing Muscle Meridians 14th point. So on this point, what we'll do with the help of the jimmy, we'll press this point properly for one minute. Okay, you need to press it properly for one minute, and then after that, again we'll take one more tonification sedation magnet or Buell magnet and apply it in such the way that the white side of the magnet will touch the skin, and from the outside you can see the yellow side of the magnet. That means you need to do sedation of this point. You need to reduce the energy of this point. So we'll apply one tonification sedation magnet on this point properly. Similarly, you need to do it on the other hand also. This treatment is bilateral. So do remember, whenever applying magnets, you need to apply it for eight to ten hours, and whenever you will remove it, you need to throw the paper tip away and bring both the magnets together so that they can energize themselves and you can use it again. Magnets do not expire. So do this treatment daily. You will definitely feel the results. Okay. So if you are having only cold, then only do the cold points and do not do the fever points. If you are having both, then do both acupressure points. Okay. So that's all for today. Thank you.